Hey guys, welcome to another episode. So today another gear review. It's gonna be about the Marmot Crane Creek 3-person uh, ultralight tent. So I bought this uh, on Amazon. It was uh, quite a deal. I bought it for $100. Um, so I told myself, hey, that, that could be the perfect uh, tent for a uh, secondary tent or family tent. Because I already own an uh, ultralight tent. Uh, it's a copper spur. Uh, UL2. So I said, why not? 100 bucks. I mean, let's go. Uh, so I'm gonna give you my uh, honest review today. Uh, I have not used it yet, but I will, um, you know, put it up and see uh, the quality of the stand and the waterproofing. So first off, for sure, this is not a backpacking tent uh, for one person. So if you want to take this and split it, maybe in two or three packs, it, this is fine. This is about five pounds, um, so it's not too bad in weight. But I can see it more uh, used on maybe bike packing um, or bike touring uh, trips. So uh, I'm gonna open it and uh, we'll see how, how it is. So this is the final result uh, where it's well staked out. I also put the middle tube here. There's also ventilation here. So you can see it's quite big, two vestibules. So you can have two person easily. So again, here, ventilation. So let's see inside. So I'm six foot tall, so the entry. Easy. As we go inside, you can see I'm six foot, six foot tall. And I've got ample space. So it's really a very large two person tent. Uh, maybe with a kid, uh, I don't think three adults could fit in there. Well, they could, but it would be very, very tight. Um, there's small pockets there. Your stuff in. A uh, small hook here to put the light. But well, all in all, it's limited. There's no pouches here or anything. So uh, inside, the vestibules are quite large. You can put your bag, no problem there. Um, but uh, yeah, it looks good. Okay, now let's see if it's waterproof. Okay, so let's go see inside. The waterproofing is correct. So, it's perfect. Everything is dry. So, waterproof. Nothing inside is dry as a bone. In resume, this stand for 100 bucks, Canadian of Amazon. I think it's a steal. Uh, I mean, it's a little bit heavy, but you know, five, six pounds is perfect to carry on a bicycle. Uh, the waterproofness is uh, quite impressive for a uh, hundred dollar uh, tent. So if, if you can get this tent uh, uh, in reduced price, then I would go for it, and I will for sure use this with my family. Uh, for small um, cycling tours uh, because it's quite uh, it's quite big and it's uh, honestly quite good quality so uh, I would recommend uh, 
to stand and I will give you more uh, maybe in-depth review when I will actually use it on the field for the moment. It seems well built and uh, good to go.